everyone, it's Nana Party Time, and tonight I am reading Pete the Cat Construction Destruction by James Dean. Recess! Pete shouts as the bell rings, but when Pete goes outside to play, oh no, the playground is a disaster. The swings are broken, the slide is rusty, and the sandbox is full of weeds. Pete makes plans for a new playground. Wow, says Principal Nancy. Can you really build that? Not by myself, says Pete. I'm going to need some help. Whatever you need, Pete, it's all yours. Rumble, rumble, honk, honk. The next day, Pete arrives at the playground before school. The construction crew is already there. He gives them the go ahead to tear down the old playground. Down goes the slide, creak, crash. Down goes the swings, clank, clank. Down goes the tower, bang, boom, and a truck arrives to recycle the metal. Rumble, rumble, honk, honk. The new playground equipment has arrived. It's time to get to work. The cement mixer will pour concrete, the dump truck will bring sand and dirt, and the backhoe will dig. The whole team will get the job done. Clunk, whack, thud. Building a playground is very hard work. The new playground is cool, but it's not cool enough. What do you think, Pete asked, holding up his latest plans. It will be too hard to build, says one of the workers, and everyone is almost finished, says another. But it will make this the best playground ever, Pete says. Then let's do it, the workers say. Screwdrivers twist in screws, wrenches tighten the nuts. The workers try to make everything perfect. Hooray, the new playground is ready. Everyone is amazed until, creak, 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 uh-oh. <gasps> Smash, crutch, thud. Oh no, says Principal Nancy as the new playground crashes to the ground. The pieces are all mixed up. Everyone is so disappointed except for Pete. It's not how we planned it, Pete shouts. It's even better. The playground is filled with surprises and places to explore. The school playground is the most amazing playground ever. Sometimes you've got to dare to dream big. And that's the end of the story. If you like the story, like the video, make a comment that you love the story. And if there's something that you really want Nana Party Time to read, uh, post the, the name of the book on under the comments, and I will read it. And so, good night. And Lily and Phoenix, if you're listening to Nana, read the book. Good night to you, too. I love you. I will upload more later.